Yo gang, back again, back again, back again, back again, oi. Massive shout out goes to... And a massive shout out to HM for being so patient as well. And this one is Real Artillery and Ratman the Combo Part 3. So without further ado, let's get into this one. Disclaimer on that. Fam, Rap man, come everything. on. Finally. What, man took everything, yeah? Man's got a goal, you know, right? What, 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 Them overhead shots are doing bits as well, man. It's well put together, man. Mm, young Drill is on top, yeah? Cool to shoot. Yo. Can you hear me? Go on, you listen. See that food that you took, that was mine. Yeah. I'm gonna need you to That's what I now. thought, you know. Like, you remember from the last one, innit? Hey, what fam? I ain't running back a damn thing. Man, I don't run back a shot from my hand. Yeah, man, I got phony man's phone on a mad thing. Where you come from? What's your ranking? What's your block count? You want this gang thing? Furthermore, how you get my number? You're gambling with your life, fam. I ain't up for this gang thing. When it comes to war, I'm the last man standing. I'm here cool and I'm talking all calm, but you're coming on the phone and you're talking all shit. Y'all know about me, but I know who you are. No way you get in, got the plate to your car. You ain't bad just because you done a bit. Never been cool for a thing that I did. Every thing that I've done, cause I've done that inside. If I made the one, don't make me have to get fired. Let me say it one more time. Hear me, bro. Ride on the pitch, your work as a clown, you cry like a bitch. You rolled in my town, I put five in your whip. I never in it, I, in it. I, I was in jail on the word of a snitch. All that tough talk don't work with a kid when I buck you. Could have put a friend in the quick. I'm not hearing that it. That's worth to the I fifth. already know how this thing's gonna go. You wanna stay here talking who's badder? You wanna talk about guns and I talk about something? We start talking about who's mad about. But the fact of it is, with this back and forth shit, I'm the only one here knows the other shot. I could be any man that you buck up on the road, that you throw about that there brother. I could be that brother in the barbershop with a cat in the car while you bust the shot. Just as a tramp with a stiller in my hand while I lay there chilling outside your block. Never sleep. Nah. <laughs> 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 nah. I'm you while you feel your tight. Cause you're never gonna see me coming. Just hear a man bang then it turns to black. Yeah, 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 straight. Say now. Bust Talk about bang and it all goes blank. I really do bang. I ain't holding a shank. I'm really on the field. I be holding a rack. I rock for real. That's my thing. I ain't never left my yard without my thing. Got it on my lap when I'm getting a trim. I don't sell cats no more. I'm getting it in. You think I don't know you? Check this thing. Know me, I done my homework on whose food it was way before I ate this thing. So you can be that man in the barber shop. Blatantly, you're not telling stuff. him like man you don't care. Man mix that wrong move and gets all this teeth together. Hey, I'm brother. About, we can do the streets for never on the field. I'm making Jack beat his head off. So you think you're back? I does that. You're not running it back. So fuck that. You know what's gonna be mad? Then bust that. You no, know I'm coming for that. Then come at me. I cool man bond this. I see it now. Yeah. You want beef? No problem. I'll bring it around. Right. Straight man down. I'm a teeth when I come around. Gun versus guns. Let's see who's got the biggest round. Jack tried to do this peaceful for you. Now I'm coming out with a peaceful for you. And you're saying that you're messy on the pitch. Well, I'm a Nardo. More plays and assists. What are you saying now? Think it's a game man playing round straight on site when I see you leaving lane. More players and assists, man. Said you a Ronaldo root boy. And when we do pull up on the scene, don't try and beg and ask mercy for me. Never. Think you're bulletproof, but we're soon gonna see. Better Instagram post saying I'll rap P. Watch the right now. You can do all of the smoke that you want. And you'll get it, and I put a hole in your done when I'm rolling this on. No phone in a tongue car. When it's eight cooks, the whole place shook. Do you dirty? You see how your face looks. They'll post you up on Twitter and Facebook. This pole Left a nigga like eight foot. Remember, I took your breath, it was hard though. Same way I'll take your breath, let the dark go. My heart is cold, I'm black like charcoal. Still you yeah. messy with the rap in the car though. I'm seven in your black like a nardo. Nah, fam, nah. I'm really out on the field, get his skin touched. Forget the tough talk, we need a link up. Cause I'm gonna squeeze things to the pin, bro. Hey, you don't wanna see me, blood. See where you are. Man said, I need messy, I'll put seven in your back like Ronaldo. After the bar, he spat. Oi, listen. Listen. That was mad. That was mad. They're gonna clap the minute. In it, these men were around the corner. Mmm. Man got the drop on man differently, like. 
the real artillery's combo part 3 being story based music it stands to reason that naturally if artillery was going to collaborate with any artist on the uk scene it would be ratman say he doubled up the score and i'd be done 20 more 21 who finds car will make sure that he's dead if you've watched the combo part 1 and part 2, we all know how well R.A. was able to distinguish between the two characters, using that conversation as a conduit between the two. The visuals start with that amazing opening shot that just seems to build as Ratman comes round that corner and more and more members of his operation come into shot while his workers give context to the scene in regards to Fam, this brother took everything. Finally, what, man? what, man took everything, yeah? Man's got a goal, you know? Before the music's even begun, Ratman calmly establishes his presence and authority within the group when he says and as the shot changes to real artillery coming out that building somewhere in London it's clear to see that this is Ratman's counterpart as those well placed overhead shots that we've seen throughout the entirety of the combo once again add to the visuals and then those gospel organs overlaid with pianos and kicks blended with what sounds like a cello string section stabs come in In the combo part one and two, initially you're used to real artillery's gruff vocal set in pace. Yo, yo, my brother, other day was a mad thing. Thought that the hot roll trip was a man them. Beef out air and I'm itching to slam them. Anyone could have seen us and us rang them. But with Ratman delivering his flows and bars the way he does, it really makes for a nice change of pace. As the both of them begin to go back and forth in this conversation. Yo, can you hear me? Go on, you listen. See, I feel that he took that was mine. Listening to the combo, Ratman's character's approach is one I loved. Initially, it shows his character to be someone with a level head who'd rather get his food back and get straight back to making money with his click. I'ma need you to run it back now. Do that call and everything so fast. I know you probably never knew it was my spot. Probably just got tipped on the job. Even though Ratman's character's approach is right, the real artillery's character wouldn't know whether he's able to trust Ratman's word. So naturally, his reply made sense. Hey, what fam? I ain't running back a damn thing. Man, I don't run back a shot from my hand. Yeah. Man, I got four man's phone on a mad thing. Where you come from? What's your ranking? And here we get a deeper glimpse into that hot-headed character's nature as he proceeds to try and violate Ratman's character. What's your block hey, You want this gang thing? Furthermore, how you get my number? You're gambling. With your life fam, I ain't all this gang thing. When it comes to war, I'm the last man standing. From the start of the phone conversation in this video up until now, what was becoming evident was their attention to detail. Using those telephone style filtered out ad libs to give their conversation that more realistic, natural response, whilst using those responses in perfect timing with the beat. As the real artillery sat down in the car, that heated conversation reminded me of so many arguments I'd seen like that growing up. Right down to that way, he held the phone up to his face and was literally talking to it. I was in jail on the word of a snitch. All that tough talk don't work with a kid when I buck you. Could have put a friend in the wig. If you've listened to any types of music collaborations, there are those special moments where artists choose to go back and forth. But for real artillery and rap man to do this while still in character is something that speaks to these brothers' creative and musical abilities. I does that. You're not running it back, so fuck that. You know what's gonna be mad? Then bust that. You no, know I'm coming for that. Then come at. And when you add the fact of them showing their abilities as lyricists, when Ratman says, And you're saying that you're messy on the pitch, well, I'm a Nardo, more pain than assist, what are you saying now? And then with real artillery replying, These guys really think about the music they create. Throughout this entire exchange, they just seem to up the ante, raising the levels of tension between the two characters as they both threaten and respond to each other. Tell your worker, hold his head, keep his chin up, because I'm really out on a field, get his skin touched, forget the tough talk. When we Real Artillery's use of space in this combo series has been something that kind of came as a surprise at first. <laughs> which each time you see it adds a bit more realism to the fact that they're having a convo. You're never gonna see me coming. Just hear my bang then it turns to blank. When Ratman's character says, Wait, you don't wanna see me, blood. See where you are, dude. You didn't quite understand that his actions were gonna be so immediate, leading to Real Artillery's character ending up being surrounded, almost like a one man against 10 Mexican standoff minus the guns. 
which all makes for a pretty tense ending to the combo part three. Real Artillery and Ratman's chemistry on this song is clear to see, and it was good to see them working together again recently on Shiro's Story 3. I should slap him in his head, chop his body in the free. Nah, man can let him live for a small amount of pee. With Ratman quite rightly saying in his Tim Westwood interview, We've done one, two and three for YouTube, and I think we done what we can for YouTube. We're trying to go, you know, we're trying obviously, to... Yeah, we want Netflix. Obviously. I hope The Real Artillery gives us a few more episodes of the combo. Let me know what you thought of the combo part three in the comment section down below and I'll see you down there. Yo, gang, it's your boy Lee to the VI saying, peace and love, and I'm out. Bow. <laughs>